Back in the early 90s, my husband and I moved out here from the Hudson Valley and we discovered the Rockwell Museum and found it to be a, a truly remarkable place, especially for a small town like Corning. Uh, we enjoyed, you know, looking at the art and we came often. It was kind of a respite from being outside. And, uh, quite calming and a friend who worked here asked me if I'd be interested in volunteering and it just sort of seemed like a no-brainer. Um, I was already coming quite often and it, it just seemed like it suited me well and once I started learning about the art and uh, becoming more comfortable giving tours and stuff I just thought oh, yeah it was, a, it was the right choice that's exactly what I should be doing. What I gain from volunteering here at the museum is a lot more than I give, I can tell you that much right there. Um, first of all, I'm learning an awful lot uh, about history, about art, about museums, and I'm getting to meet artists, contemporary artists, who can tell me why they do things and how they do things. So the learning process is a huge factor for me. Um, but Interestingly enough, something I hadn't, hadn't occurred to me originally that I might enjoy and that was giving tours to children um, because actually I'm learning a lot from them as well. Um, we do a visual thinking strategies kind of a program here and that uh, allows me to ask the children what they see and what they think and how they feel about the art and they come, they come up with things I have never noticed before. Actually seeing things in pictures I've looked at over and over and they notice something that I've never noticed. So uh, I'm learning from them as well and I didn't know that I would enjoy that so much. Um, I of course enjoy giving tours to adults as well uh, and that's a whole different way of dealing with the public and dealing with the art, you can say different things, but uh, with the children it's a magical, magical time and uh, gosh, I've, I've gained out, working with them is, is, has been really a, a true gift, a real gift. I learned so much and I have gotten a deeper and richer understanding of the art that we've had, the, the uh, uh, older pieces. But I keep going because I learn something new every time I look at them. Uh, I keep coming back. We have new exhibitions all the time, so I have to learn new things uh, from different parts of the country about different types of people, not only Native Americans, but also the settlers who went west. And because we have new exhibits all the time, I'm learning from the artists who uh, are making art today. And that's invaluable uh, because I'm not only learning um, the richness of what's out there if you combine the past with the present. I'm also learning what Native Americans are doing today, which, which we, in the past we never had really a voice for Native Americans. And the, the um, ability to teach about Native American history and tradition and concepts and spirituality uh, is uh, a phenomenal thing. Uh, because we didn't get that in history books. So I keep coming back, but actually the bottom line is um, I come back because this is a cool place to be. I love being amongst beautiful things, the history. I love the people here, the volunteers as well as the staff. They're all enthusiastic and willing to help and uh, encouraging and supportive. Uh, and I really feel like I'm contributing something. I'm making a difference, not only in the museum, which of course needs volunteers, but also in the community. I feel like I'm an integral part of the community and helping really lift the community to a new level. And uh, that's also a, a, a great feeling, a very rewarding feeling. So I'll keep coming back as long as um, this museum just gets better and better.